Interesting. It's a pesticide that's been used in Kern County in the past. Now a judge wants it banned across the nation. A decision today putting that effort in motion. Experts say the pesticide can be harmful to children and it's reportedly been used heavily here in Kern County. 23 ABC's Alyssa Flores spoke to the United Farm Workers Foundation today who says that this is a victory not just for those coming into direct contact with the pesticide, but for anyone that eats fruits and vegetables. Alyssa. Tim, Jessica, we are talking about chlorpyrifos. It's a pesticide that's said to be harmful to the brain and to the nervous system. And today, a court ordering the Environmental Protection Agency to ban chlorpyrifos altogether. We know based on state data that it has been widely used, potentially harmful and widely used here in Kern County. An ongoing effort and battle uh, trying to uh, ban its full use. Now a win for the United Farm Workers Foundation and others who oppose the use of chlorpyrifos, a pesticide said to be harmful to the nervous system and brain, especially harmful in children. We know that this is a victory not for us here in California, but also throughout the United States. Thursday, an appeals court ruling the Trump administration endangered the public by allowing the pesticide to stay on the market, regardless of proof that exposure could harm the brains of babies, which the UFW says is a concern not only for the health of farm workers, but the people they come home to. They come home, they hug their kids uh, with that very same clothes that came in contact with the pesticide. Used on almonds, oranges, apples and broccoli, Kern County is one of the top users of chlorpyrifos in the state. State data showing in 2015 more than 1.1 million pounds of chlorpyrifos were used in California, more than a quarter of that in Kern County alone. Uh, this is a public um, health concern. It's not just regarding farm worker safety, it's the whole uh, public. But the UFW not too quick to celebrate the ban. Although we are expecting for another fight to try to come back and reverse the decision. The EPA has said in a statement that they will be reviewing the court's decision. Chlorpyrifos should never come uh, to a field again. It should never be placed on our fruits and vegetables. In the past, California's EPA has considered banning that pesticide, and the UFW says that they hope they decide to move in that direction so that regardless of what's decided on the federal level, chlorpyrifos will stay out of California. In Northeast Bakersfield, Alyssa Flores, 23 ABC.